Thank you for joining me. Welcome to Let Go and Trust God. In this prayer meditation, we will ask God to help us deal with whatever is happening in our lives right now, to surrender our fears, worries, and control to the Almighty Creator of the universe, placing our trust in Him and His plans for our lives. Let's begin. Dear God, thank you for your presence. You are always nearby. You always hear us. You are our Abba Father, protector, giver of wisdom, courage, and strength. Lord, we come to you today weighed down by the burdens and challenges of life. Our hearts are heavy with difficult feelings, feelings like fear, discouragement, disillusionment, anxiety, stress, anger, helplessness, sadness, pain, despair. Please take these weights from us. We long to release them to you. We know it is not your will that we face life's challenges alone in our own strength. You have told us to bring all our concerns to you, no matter what their size. You care for us. You want to be with us in whatever we're facing, to shoulder our burdens, to lead the way, to take charge, to be in control. Thank you, Father, for loving us like this. We are grateful to be able to offer our troubles to you. Help us remember that you are bigger than anything we face. You are in charge, the creator and king of all that is, has been, and will be. It is safe for us to let go. You are in control and you are good. We can place our worries, fears, and anxieties on you. You alone know what lies in store. Not a thing happens that you don't allow. You have ordered our path and the universe. You will let us know what we need to know when we need to know it. You will show us what to do and when it is to be done. You take care of everything in your own perfect way and timing. Sometimes you give us our wish immediately. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes you give us something even better. Whatever happens, you will use it to grow us into who we are meant to become. Each time we let go and trust you, surrendering our will to yours, you transform us further and further into the likeness of your Son, Jesus Christ, turning even our problems into opportunities.
And so we ask that you help us do our part now. Help us surrender whatever we're trying to control to your greater design. Help us to trust that we will be given everything we need for today. Whatever we're worried about today will work out in its own time as it's meant to. We don't need to worry about a thing. It will all be okay. You use everything for good and have plans to prosper, not harm us, to give us hope and a future. Remembering this, let us take a few deep breaths now, inhaling, letting the air fill our lungs and chest, then gradually releasing it in a nice, smooth exhalation. And once more, making the inhalation just a bit longer, holding the breath within us, and then slowly letting it go. Every breath we take is a reminder to let go and trust you. You provide the very air that sustains us. You have ordered all the hairs on our heads and the days of our lives. You will not let anything happen to us that isn't in our best interest. Knowing this, let us release our worries. We can relax and drift along the river of the present. Secure that you are guiding the current that carries us forward. When there are rapids or we go under, we can feel safe knowing that you will draw us to the surface. You will bring us through. There is nothing we need to do or be, nothing we need to plan or control. You are in control. You are in charge. It is as it should be. Knowing this, let us enjoy the flow of life. It is good to experience the current of the moment rather than trying to control it. We can float along and pay attention to the scenery we're passing, appreciating and participating in the flow of life, absorbing all that is available to us today, enjoying the gift of life. Lord, we thank you for your faithfulness, your protection, your love, for giving us hope and a future worth having. Remembering this, we surrender all our anxieties to you. You are with us and will keep us wherever we go. Today, tomorrow, and all of our days.
In your precious name we pray, Lord Jesus. Amen.